like like Dr. Gill made these posters that are saying, you know, um, uh, like non copyright infringing Rangers wanted for defense of area, not unsimilar to Super Sentai, but you'd never heard it from us. And like, you know, really typed up and spaced out beautifully and kind of explaining broadly, like, come to us with your skills. And then what Spank McGlans did was go and write on the um, on the posters in crayon, like must do cowboy bit. <laughs> so I really want to see the whole just like cowboy character of of these new recruits. Yeah, and that's what drew me to the poster in the first place because um, I love when someone hand writes on a poster. Um, just shows like really good organization. I'm gonna try to harness like a really a really gay um, cowboy that's working at a. A rural gas station. Oh, like Matthew McConaughey. <laughs> Kinda, yeah. Yeah. All right. So, so that's uh, that's acceptable. So you guys are gonna have to, you guys are gonna have to travel to the outskirts of town to try to lasso a a uh, stereotypically gay cowboy working at a rural out of town gas station. So well, wait, so wait, wait. It's all the location. audition involves us going to find an actual unsuspecting gay cowboy. Yes, like we're all method acting. <laughs> this is this our, is, our we're going live, baby. audition. I love it. Yes. I love it. Okay, I just want to be clear you on what's so happening. Much faith in me. You're like, let's make this as good as possible. <laughs> okay. So, um, okay. So, my character, yes, Magma Glans, yes, who usually talks like Keanu Reeves, is now participating in a bit, right? I mean, this is technically a bit. Okay, so within the story, Smegma Glans is playing a cowboy named Starch McCollar. Um, <laughs> and uh, yeah, so we'll be speaking in that voice. I just wanted to be clear for the audience. We wouldn't want anyone to watch this episode and be confused or put off in any way. Well, I think my plots are very, very coherent and Absolutely. definitely don't go off the rails immediately. Yeah. So, okay. So, um, like, okay, so we're, we're, we're rolling into some kind of like Backwaters. You, you guys are in your like your your flying craft, right? Our flying cowboy craft. <laughs> okay, so we we roll up on this person, and uh, uh, I shout out from my ship in my best cowboy voice of, "Ahoy there!" We got ropes. Perfect. We got props for everything here. Yep. All right. Shoot, shoot some ropes over my way. <laughs> All right, so I'm rolling. Yeah, you're rolling because you're you're attempting to lasso a gay cowboy oh, here. Okay. All right, so you got holy shit. We got ten subtract. Your body was negative one, if I'm not yeah. mistaken. So that's a nine. Rude. You lasso him, and you ever watch like uh, calf roping or anything like that, like a rodeo sport? Oh yeah, every day. All right. Well, I was gonna say you uh, you tie him like a calf rope, but we can just say hog tie. That makes it easier, probably. Oh yeah. You don't just lasso him. You hog tie that gay cowboy. <laughs> mm -hmm. And he is This isn't a hate crime, we promise. <laughs> and you have In a, the moment the ropes landed on him, the cowboy consented to it. <laughs> and this is uh you now have a a gay cowboy all tied up. 